All right, in this video, I'm going to run down why Mr. Beast is a dark triad personality, i.e. a narcissistic Machiavellian psychopath, or just for simplicity's sake, we're just going to call him a sociopath. Here's why. First and foremost, Mr. Beast is a sociopath because of everything that was mentioned in Dog Pack 404's fantastic video. I worked for Mr. Beast. He's a fraud. If you haven't watched it already, I highly recommend it. Go watch it. I agree with everything in it. I'm not going to do a rehash on it. But what I will say for the people who are going, oh, you're just making this video now because you're jumping on the bandwagon. That's not true. Everything Mr. Beast does is a manifestation of sociopathic ideation because everything he does is done for the sole purpose of the acquisition of money, the acquisition of social status, and the stroking of his ego. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look at his profile. Oh, the banality of it all. Look how moral I am. Look how moral I am. I'm just a philanthropist. Everything I do is moral philanthropy. All my acquisition of money and status, it's only for good things, guys. It couldn't be for anything bad. And I'm also totally just like you. I just drive a normal car and live in a normal house, even though that's an obvious lie. You know, Sam Bankman fried said the same thing. And also, you know, Al Capone and Pablo Escobar did a lot of charity work. But you know what? They didn't do charity work because they were good people. They did charity work because they were sociopaths who liked to have their ego stroked and because they understood that being perceived as moral was important for them to be able to engage in their business operations. Mr. Beast is no different. In fact, Mr. Beast operates in a near identical manner to other well-known sociopathic internet scammer Logan Paul. If you've been living under a rock and you still believe Logan Paul's a good person, I recommend you go and watch CoffeeZilla's multi-part series about why he's a very bad person, why he's a sociopath, why he's a scammer, and why he's a downright criminal. Go ahead and watch it. And this neatly brings me to my final piece of evidence as to why Mr. Beast is a sociopath. If Mr. Beast had an intact moral compass, he wouldn't still be collaborating with people like Logan Paul, and he especially would not be taking people like Logan Paul and putting him front and center as the most prominent person in their most recent YouTube video. But he loves money, he loves status, and he loves preying on children, just like Logan Paul. This guy is a sociopath, and if all that didn't convince you already, just go down the Ava Chris Tyson rabbit hole and everything else involving Jimmy and Ava Chris Tyson. Anyways, that's all I got. He's friends with Logan Paul. He promotes people like Logan Paul. Everything he does is a scam. And uh, all of his close friends are also sociopaths. That's it. Bye.